I'm Father Derek from the Diocese of Kamloops and I'd like to talk a little bit about heaven. And I'd like to tie in three things. Heaven, Mass, and marriage. All three of them kind of speak the same language. What is heaven? Heaven is being one with God. Perfectly one with God. And so you could say that it is a marriage because a marriage is when a husband and wife become one. And so God is the groom and the church is the bride and we become one with God. So heaven is one big marriage. And so how does Mass tie into that? Well, Mass is a marriage of God and His people. And so Mass is like an anticipation of heaven, which is the big marriage. And Mass is marriage and it points us to heaven. So Mass, heaven, and marriage are speaking the same language. Now in heaven there is no selfishness. It's perfectly total self-giving. That's why it's perfectly one, a unity. And heaven is more about a relationship rather than a geographical place up there or out there. Rather, heaven is more about a relationship. So the relationship with God begins now. Heaven, in that sense, begins now. We don't die and then kind of go to heaven. Heaven is about a relationship that we continually work on and build and uh, nurture and nurture, uh, nourish as well through the sacramental life. And so we want to build the relationship now. That's why God is, has given us the sacraments to continue to build that relationship uh, the heavenly relationship already now and here. All it takes is one mortal sin and we break that relationship. But in the sac sacrament of confession, we're able to bring that relationship back in union with, with God. And I'd like to little end off with a quote from St. Teresa of Avila. She says, It is foolish to think that we can enter into heaven without entering into ourselves. In other words, unless we uh, enter into ourselves and get to know ourselves and God and this relationship, uh, we, how do we even begin to enter into heaven? If we're so busy doing stuff that we never actually spend time building our relationship with God, we'll just keep busy on the outside, then we never get into that relationship. That's why we need, we need quiet time, uh, prayer time, just to always nurture and uh, nourish that relationship with God which is heaven already starting here on earth right now.